Greater here cannot mean cannot mean that the Father is superior to the Son in essence. So the only plausible meaning contextually is the Father is greater in rank because Jesus explains it. John 14, 28. Let's read it carefully and we'll sum up. Let's read it carefully again. You have heard me say to you, I'm going away and I'm returning to you. If you loved me, you would rejoice. Now, he's saying, if you really love me, this shouldn't sadden you that I'm leaving you. Because after all, they spent over three years with Jesus they fell in love with Jesus and they saw nothing but goodness from Jesus. Now Jesus is saying, I won't be with you physically. Obviously they're going to be depressed and heartbroken. But he goes, if you love me, it shouldn't depress you. You should rejoice and be happy because he explains, for the Father is greater than I. Now what's the connection again? Why is Jesus saying that my departing you physically, even though I'll be present with you by the Spirit, physically I won't be with you, that shouldn't depress you, that should actually make you happy for me because the Father is greater than I. What's the connection? Well, the connection is obvious. Jesus is saying, if I remain on earth, I will remain in the state of humiliation. Because on earth, he assumed the position of a slave, a servant. Not just a slave, but a slave who was manhandled, beaten to a bloody pulp, whipped half to death, and crucified naked on a cross, and died a brutal, shameful death. So Jesus is saying, what would you rather have? Me remain in this state where the Father is greater than I in His status and position? Or would you rather see me glorified with the Father, regaining the glory I had before the world was, a glory I set aside in order to take the state of humiliation for your salvation? If you love me, don't you want the best for me? That's, right. That's exactly his point. And this is confirmed by John 17, 5. Father, this is what our Lord says, glorify me together with yourself with the glory I had with you before the world was. In other words, if I remain on earth, that glory that I had with the Father, showing that I am God and worthy of worship, will remain <clears throat> set aside. But if I return, that glory will be mine once again. Because if I don't return, then I remain in the state of humiliation, and the Father remains greater than I. But if I return, then we are one in glory, in honor, in majesty. That's the contextual meaning. Amen.